on Heartbeat Cat Academy. Ah. She's there, right there, I found her. You, this is me now. That's me behind the tree. Intelligence, charisma, and beauty. And she lives next door. Too bad she's out of your league. She will be mine. I will make her mine. Secret crush cat evolves into girlfriend cat. Yes, she finally said yes. Always bring homemade cat fruit sandwiches. Cat fruit sandwiches. 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 Huh. Can't do this anymore, girlfriend cat. I'm breaking up with you. You're too high maintenance. I can't keep farming cat fruit stages for you. So, you're terrible. Goodbye. And now. Oh boy, it's that time of year again. That special day where we get to celebrate. White Day. You know, that fun holiday. Controversial banner name aside, it does have a brand new unit called Love Struck Lesser Demon. It's my Balrog, but he's in love. Aww. There's also a new Galaxy Girl out as well. She looks kind of bored. I, th I think she's wondering why she's even here. Target acquired, one shot is all I need. Terran, a lightning bow that never misses. Oh no, it's Belle Delphine. So she is unique to the game right now in the sense that she actually does extra damage to... Wait for it. That's right, Colossal Enemies. A new archetype, I suppose, even though it's been out for a while. But Ponus has made it a new archetype because they've made the Colossal Enemies stronger and more painful to do. To a degree where I'm not saying you're gonna need Ubers. There are definitely some out there who can definitely do it without Ubers. And I acknowledge you. However, for perhaps the smaller brained, who I acknowledge as well, Huntress Terran might be pretty good. I might be quite essential. Now, I'm not a fan of a game that creates a problem and then creates a solution which involves your wallet. So, here's what I'm gonna do I wanna do White Day. I want. Love struck lesser demon. Potentially we can use that in the new season three and season four of Heartbeat Cat Academy. And you know what? If uh if we get him, we'll we'll try rolling in this instead, okay? Let's see. Who who else do we not have here? I think we have oh we don't have you, maybe? Bruh, who have I got all these girls? I think I got them all. Oh, we're missing one. I don't know who it is. Oh, we're missing Windy. We got Hallow Windy, but we don't have the Windy. Okay, understood. We also don't have the twins, but quite frankly, don't really care for them. Oh man, and we missed out on Valentine's version of Marcia. Bro, Mar Marcia is great. Holy crap, I love her. <laughs> I love her. Okay, so we got like 33 pulls. Let's go ahead and do the first one. Okay. Um, there are like other units here, mind you. I I hope there's like an increased chance for this guy right here. He's he's new, he's limited. He's gonna be probably uh, kind of crap, I'm not gonna lie to you. But imagine having like another Balrog on your team. He'll be somewhat okay, right? Wait, what, what does he even do? Plus, inflicts various negative status effects on any enemy with a trait. Ah. Oh. Okay, okay. Anything else here I would love? I I have Hayabusa. I don't rate him highly. He looks badass, but don't rate him highly. I think I have uh, the, the Cat Clan heroes. I haven't used them. Kintaro's okay. Don't really want one plus. Hades I got recently and um, never used. So, Shiro? Isn't Shiro the new one? Yeah, I would love Shiro. Oh, yo, bro, if you give me Shiro and also like, I don't, I don't really want these. Wait, what the hell was that? Hold up. Oh, what is this? Brainwashed Axe Cat. Okay, I want that too. Ponos, write that down. I want that. I want, give me the world. Can we get that over here? We cannot get it in the Galaxy Girls. Oh man. Okay, well, <laughs> let's go. Let's do it. Let's, let's rip off this Band-Aid. Come on, man. Give me all the things I want in the world. That's, that's not what I want in this world. Rover Cat, absolutely not. Now we do have like over 100 tickets. I am saving them for a big special stream. So don't worry about that. We won't be spending those, unfortunately. Matador Cat, you know, I love that thick behind she has. Absolute goals. Omnaji, meh, very meh. Bota Vista, honestly, free MP. We need more MP. It's not really free, we're, we're, we're paying cat food for this sh but still, 
Viking Cat is big meh. I, I don't want to use Viking Cat. Shaman Cat applies slow to floating. I don't think it's it's worth leveling up. Um, yes, okay. We got Brainwash Cat. That's awesome. That is so good. Okay. Oh, that's dope. Now just, just give me a Love Struck Demon now. Give me my Love Struck Balrog, please. All okay, right, okay, all right, all right, all right. We're encroaching guaranteed pull right now, I think. Bruh. <laughs> Bruh. Very well. So honestly, that was just about as lucky as you can get. I will take that. Yo, the two of them together are gonna be so powerful. Do I love it. I lo <laughs> Yo. People call me lucky sometimes in this game. There are like moments where I'm like, I have a long period of unluckiness. If you go to like my streams where I'm like, I'm trying to pull D'Artagnan Cat for about four years now, you may have noticed I don't have a D'Artagnan Cat. I am still without D'Artagnan Cat. I have spent hundreds, literally hundreds, almost half a thousand on that boy to try and get him and no D'Artagnan Cat. But yo, I'll take this. That's pretty dope. Now, do we even dare go for to run over here? Or do I just keep on rolling here? Honestly, we got the mass amount of things we want from here. To be honest, it ain't even worth pulling on this. Mm, mm. <laughs> I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll do it. I'll do it once. And if I don't get her, I don't get her. Because I... <sighs> When you get a lot of like Ubers in that one set, it becomes a lot less worth it in the end. And you're kind of like, well, uh, uh, I don't. Like the, the chance of a dupe, yo, great units, always one plus. The thing is, a dupe's not that bad anymore in this game, but an Uber dupe does still hurt me inside. It's still pretty goddamn painful, but it is free MP. So you can make your, your selected units that you want to use more often, more powerful. So it's, I think MP was a great addition to the game. It did definitely make the whole duplicate system less painful. Because a one plus for an Uber is is hardly anything. Okay, so no out of guarantee Ubers so far. I'm t look, I got lucky, so I'm not not too mad. Sniper cat? Is that worth one plusing? The deal with Sniper Cat is it knocks back and slows. It's already like Tuesday's effects, right? I don't think it does much damage. I don't think you want it to do much damage. I think this is a good old sell. I'm Naji, and we're creeping up on our galaxy girl here. Divine Marcia, I do love her. I'll take it. We can't have them all. I also take my 1 million experience points. Now do we do it again for T-Run? Hmm. I would really love a anti-colossal enemy unit. Now she's gonna be the first of many. Right now, okay, delivers extra damage while taking less damage from them as well. Area attacks 100% slow for red and alien enemies. That's really interesting. With a chance of savage blow too, she has everything. She's gonna be like a long distance attacker as well, which is pretty good. Like. Long distance attackers are gonna be pretty good. It doesn't say that here. She uses a bow. She's gonna be in the back. Yes, yeah, let's, let's give it a go. Come on, man. Give me t rom ma'am. Come on, man. Gunslinger, no. 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 Ripping off that band-aid, no. No. Oh, kind of sad. I didn't get any outside guarantee Ubers here, man. I'm not, I'm, look. Oh, god damn it. I didn't want these at all. Twin stars. Don't diss my favorite units. They are amazing. I don't want twin stars. I don't care if it's new. All right. Well, I guess castle stages will always be difficult for me. Oh, what a mess. Um, okay. I'll sort this out later. And I'm gonna upgrade this guy for sure. Let's go. Very expensive, I know. Oh my god, my experience points. <laughs> You gotta go hard, bro. All right, we'll leave it there because my experience points is is sick. So you have lesser demon cat and as evolved forms a greater demon cat and greater barrel cat. However, Lobstruck lesser demon. This is his prequel story. This is like before he became the the Balrog demon that we know him today. This is like him in, in, in school. A fierce looking punk leader often called demon bashes those he fancies with a boat case symbolizing his love. Yo, Marcia, watch out. He's coming for you. I ship those two. I ship those two. It's, it's official now. I make the cat game lore now. It's official. Inflicts various negative effects on traded. What are those effects? It is weaken. It is freeze. It is slow. 
and knockback. There is no information about the chances, if it's guaranteed or not. Let me go to the internet. Cyberspace set free. Hello, virtual reality. Everything's the same. His recharge time, his attack animation, his knockback, his movement speed, everything. In fact, no, he's a little bit faster. But what he does now is he can also apply... Wait, hold on. 3% chance to knock back. 30% chance to freeze. Okay, so does he have a 30% chance for each one? Or is it like 30% chance to apply all of them? If it's like 30% chance to apply one of them per hit, that's extremely good. That's very powerful. Yo, please give him a third form in the future, man. I'm begging you. Maybe change the banner name from White Day to something else. Maybe like Multicultural Day is pretty, um, 2022. Okay, now we can do season three field trip. Let's go. Honestly, this will be an absolute breeze. And we're gonna use our love struck unit here. Long awaited trip. Yo, he looks so cool, even with the bouquet. He has like a JoJo hat going on. You see how his hat's merged with his hair? Is that a JoJo reference? Is that a his recharge time is the same here. He's also going up against traitless enemies, so he's not really doing much here. Let me let me keep trying him out. Man, I was really hoping for some traded enemies to test this bad boy out, but... Oh! A flying enemy! Finally! Okay, he missed. He'll get the, the moth soon, don't worry about it. Okay, he's gonna keep on attacking everything else. Okay, oh, never mind. Special stage. Sudden call from your crush. <gasps> She's calling me? It's been... Been two years since our breakup. I, I don't think I'm ready for this. Yes. <laughs> Girlfriend Cat Chan. I. I didn't think you would call. Ugh, get out of the way! Love me! This is so romantic, finally. Uh oh! Arrival! Woo, 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 woo. Quickly! Go, love struck Balrog! Uh oh. Who's gonna get there first, man? <laughs> oh, I killed her. One love letter. <sighs> oh, oh, a dog. Hold on. It froze it in time, but it didn't do everything. So it is a 30% chance for each status effect. Now I wonder if he can apply multiple status effects at the same time. Because if he can apply multiple status effects every single time, this guy is really strong. He did, he did weaken and frozen. So each one is a 30% chance to, to work out. So he could possibly apply every single status effect. I think people were saying this unit was kind of like meh. I'm saying this unit is really good. Are you kidding me? Yeah, he's not as strong as the third form of Balrog, right? He also just died there. But he does have the same HP as third form Balrog. He probably won't be getting a third form, at least not for like another four to five years knowing Ponos. You can also remember he's like another unit you can use on top of Balrog. The great pillar fights. I mean, he has all the benefits and cons of a normal Balrog, right? So he has a quick recharge time, so you can summon quite a lot. He's kind of cheap as well. So the thing is with him, is on a stage where you get like a lot of money, he's actually extremely beneficial. Problem is, his range is abysmal, which is why he's given like the high amount of HP, I'm guessing, so his knockbacks aren't as, a, as frequent. I see you. You think I don't see you? In fight slumber. My god, what's going on? I honestly think he is one of the rare cases where, and again, I don't know what kind of like category he does lie in. Is he like a seasonal Uber? Is he like, he's like a limited Uber, right? But not in the sense of like the, the greats, like D'Artagnan Cat and Matama and Gao and the other new ones that don't matter. Sorry, Castly. Castly fans be like. Overall, right now, compared to my OG Barok, though, yeah, he is much, much weaker. Not only does he have no true form, but he's also severely lacking the talents as well. He's not fantastic, but I really like him. <laughs> Another call? No way. Yes? Can I help you? Let me just kill these tiny peons to get to my girlfriend, Chan. She only has 10 health, honestly, kind of pathetic. Try leveling up. 
kind of cringe, honestly. Thank you so much for one love letter. Just one. And now we can finally move on to season four. Apparently, this is going to be easier than the last one. Restrictions are... Oh, no. <laughs> Heartbeat Cat Academy units only. Does that mean love struck Barog? It doesn't mean... Love struck greater demon? This upsets me. I suppose this is gonna be our lineup. Before we start this, I do have some tickets to spend. And I don't mean the good tickets. I mean the, the garbage ones. So let's go ahead and do this. And we're gonna try and get as many of these units as possible here. We're gonna go ahead and speed run this. Because you've seen it all before. And then I'll let you know how many we get here. It, there's some free items there. We do want treasure radars. Experience up as well is also quite nice. I'm always hungry for more experience points. And uh, I'm always too lazy to do the experience stages. But I did grind quite a few tickets off screen. Not like, you know, in the hundreds. I was close to a hundred. I would love to... Oh no, I have to go over here now. Ugh. How much MP is this? One MP? Not worth it. Not worth it at all. Just do this because it is, at the end of the day, free levels towards your user rank and I can get you better stuff in the long run. Like a, uh, a platinum ticket though. Okay, so the last couple of like tickets have been pretty stinky, I'm not gonna lie to you. We're talking like, I, I had like literally a temple, wow. I had a temple with literally only one unit in it. And then it was followed by a temple with only two units in it. It was kind of rough, I'm not gonna lie to you, but we have 25 uh, plus on our lion cat. Almost 30 plus, which is the max, and I wanna try and max these guys out. Only four of these. This guy's kind of tragic right now. Only a 17 plus. Damn. And the problem here is I have to keep on going. We're gonna get duplicates of these. Only three of these. Only 18 plus. So at this point, we're going to be maxing out the lion version, the tomboy lion cat. We're going to be getting duplicates of tomboy lion cat while hunting for the other two. And it's it's just so tragically not worth MPing, but we have to do it because there's no other choice. I'm a little bit butthurt. So chalkboard eraser cat finally evolves into chalkboard punk cat. And again, is that some kind of Jojo? <laughs> Veteran of the disciplinary committee, who is the feared leader of the graffiti cleanup squad. Tough versus red enemies with area attacks. Area attacks actually seems kind of dope, but I'm pretty sure his attack is garbage. Waiting at the spot. I hope she'll be there. Oh my god. Oh no. The moment of truth. <laughs> I have really enjoyed this little like weird gimmicky event, I'm not gonna lie to you. I hope they do more. This is like legit being really fun. I also hope they don't just go back to it the next year and repeat it. I hope they keep it fresh, man. I, well, that was it. Rising heart rate. I hope they keep on doing new stuff or maybe even expanding on this later on. Cause I saw this event and I was like, oh, this event looks garbage, really? But I, I've actually enjoyed it. I <laughs> might be the only one, but I really enjoyed this. Okay, um, yep, there goes that. She actually came. Are you allowed to say that, Ponos? Uh-oh, Red Wind. That must have been painful to release. <laughs> Look at all the chalkboard cats, man. <laughs> Look at them go. The Iron Wall Defense, you can't beat this. I uh, quite frankly, don't even bother using Girlfriend Cat. Whoops, Girlfriend Cat, uh, ooh, sucks. Not because she's my ex, okay? I'm unbiased here on my channel when I rate cats. She just sucks, okay? Girlfriend cat? She's not very good, honestly. And quite needy and high maintenance and always complains all the time and she will only play video games. Cool. Victory's mine. One brave step. I hope she steps on me. I hope that one brave step is on my neck. <laughs> Oh my god! Black wind! Terrifying. Very scary. Cool. That was very simple. Scattered Sakura. Sakura. Oh my god, the Sakura blossoms. Oh, why, why are we underground? <laughs> Dude, I'm hooked. I want to know how this ends. Trust me, I didn't know I was going to get this hooked. I want them to add more characters into the, the, the Cat Academy storyline. I want it to be like a plot twist. I want it to be like a love rival. I want more. <laughs> Give me more! <laughs> Expand on the pocket universe. Give me the sweet lore, the cat lore. We're all secretly wanting and 
trying to get. It's the only reason why we all play this game still is for the sweet cat lore. We want to know who is Castaway Cat. Because really, I already know. Uh oh, the difficulty has ramped up. I mean, I'm, I'm very lucky that Tomboy Cat is the level that she is right now. Because otherwise, I think we'd definitely struggle this stage here. We're still struggling on the stage, mind you. Just don't summon Girlfriend Cat, whatever you do. And we should. I'll summon one. I'll summon one Girlfriend Cat. She would be useless, though. There we go. Eventually, we got past the many colors of winds. Uh, victory is mine. We get one more cat ticket. It's not the end. Okay, it gets harder then? Moral support? Uh-oh. That sounds like friend zone. Friend zone alert. Friend zone alert. Oh, my God. Why are we in hell? I guess this is, like, like our heart right now. It feels like... It's in hell. Oh, well, that was very easy. Where's my moral support, though? Unheard confessions. It's finally time. Oh my god, this... Yo, who'd have thought asking a girl out would, would take so much effort? I'm not gonna lie to you, this, these stages have been kind of difficult. You really gotta grind some tickets out to make sure your units are prepared for these levels. I think I got very lucky that my tomboy cat, which is like my main GPS unit right now, is the level that she is. Otherwise, this might be kind of difficult here, but we got our cat ticket. It ain't, it ain't over yet. It still ain't over. No longer single? Did it happen? Did it finally happen? Yo, the tension's killing me. I want this cat. Can we not get this cat unit? Okay, let me guess. More wind. More wind when we hit the base. Yep, there's more wind. Yep. There it is. Finally, we did it. No longer single, question mark. Red tickets. It's over. I need answers. What happened? Did she say yes? We'll never find out if she finally said yes. That's it. We'll never know. Until next year when Cat Academy comes back for a part three video series? What? That's, it's so, so exciting. Man, it's like waiting for Attack and Titan for like another year. It's just, I can't wait to wait one more year. Anyways, guys, that was Cat Game. That was pretty fun. Yo, watch my Super Order Pets video, please. Go watch it. It's funny. So... Oh! <sighs> Tell Grandma about it, too. Grandma... And this video. Just... Talk to Grandma more often. About me. I think that's it. I think that's. I'm thinking I'm gonna just go ahead and do a little.